Welcome back folks to another episode of Homestead Fabricator. Today I'm going to show you how to calibrate the 45 degree angle as it can be off. Same basic principles as doing the zero degree or straight ahead cuts. Use the speed square to check alignment. You can't see it, but yeah, basically the same thing as tape up, but when you angle it, you have a couple of choices here. Put the angle this way, then when it turns, that should be flat up against that. I had a problem with some cuts, so I'm going to check it. It helps turn the wrench the correct way. Well, the uh, tight or loose and directional. And this uh, Chicago Electric, it takes 17 millimeter. Now, let's see how close that is to being accurate. Sorry if I'm in the way. it off. That's why my cuts are all ended up goofy. Don't know if this way is going to be any better. some blade deflection so you got to be careful how much pressure you put on it you're going to set this up still a gap. What you might have, what I may end up doing is taking that out to grind out the slot. That would help to clean that out. Alright, that's the next step. Take these bolts out. Clean the debris out of there. I just noticed there was a buildup of grinder dust. Well, chips and fine dust. So there's a lot of buildup there. Never hurts to do that. Install the bolts. Feels like the brake out in here. Oh, 
what I do these days is I'll get the compressor hooked up. And I can just run the blowgun on that. Okay, that's cleaned out. Well, the threads are. This is being a little, there we go, it more or less chased the threads and that's cleaned out. Now that should line up, because I was getting a gap, and here this is being exaggerated, but it was about with this. So, now we'll check. Okay, now, now it's accurate. That bit of dust was contaminating it. Snug that up good. Don't need to do much. Check calibration again. Yeah, it's Right there, bring the camera in so you can see it better from this angle. What I'm doing here is put the speed square with the flat part up against the abrasive wheel. And there might be a, it's pretty accurate now. Cause it can turn all the way, so. That's my shop tip of the week, tell Lexon folks. Take care, get out there and build something.